Foghat with My Babe. This is CBT Guitar Lesson for Sarah. <clears throat> a lot of slide guitar in here, Sarah. And I'll tell you right up front, I'm not the best slide player in the world. I've got the ear to figure it out. Just uh, I don't have enough time using a slide. But I'll do my best. I've done it before. so um, Actually, we don't need the slide yet. It's standard tuning. Section 1 coming in at 0 seconds. It's just a G5 power chord. 3-5. And we're going to go down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up. And then on that final up, I can hear the 5D. Um, you can isolate it or you can just keep it as the chord. Um, and then this is kind of cool. 7A, third fingers. 5A, third fingers, slide to 7. 5D, 7D, pull off to 5, to 7A. So it's... So it does that seven times, and then section 1B comes in at 23 seconds, and it starts at 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. And then G major, full bar chord, barred third, starting on the A, go 5, 5, 4, and go, just strum, and then move it over to an F, two frets over, and that rings. Okay, then section 1C comes in at 45 seconds. And um, you've got 10A, barred 12th fret, D, G, and B. Go up, up. Um, so up, up, and then move it to a D major. 10th fret bar, 12A, 12D, 11G, and go up, down. So. Section 2 comes in at 48 seconds, and this is uh, the verse, I believe. And it's the G major bar. And it's really a 1-4-5, which is common in blues. So it'd be... So up, down, up, up, down, up. Um, then this is a C with the G bass. 3-3-5-5-5. Three, three, five, five, five. Go up, down, up, up, down, up. Right back to the G. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Back to the C with the G bass. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Back to the G. D with an A bass, so it's five five seven seven seven. Up, down, up, down, up. And then move it a whole step flat to C with the G bass. Up, down, up, down, up. To the G major again. Up, down, up, down, up, up. And then it goes three five five A D G up. Move it up a half step down, and then five seven seven up down. So it's so coming off the G, it's I'd be a and then section three at one oh eight. Pretty cool little run here. It's um. Barred first fret E and B, slide to three, up down, up, five G B, three G B, hammer to four G. Here are two notes there, right? So two G, five D. The next one at one twelve starts the same way. Slide up down. 5 G B and then 3 on the G you're gonna do a series of trills four times to the fourth fret hammer pulls to a 5 D at the end try not to count them try to go for the feel of it that is three times the that goes three times through and then a slide bar does come in I went ahead and grabbed it now one of the guitar players keeps the slide on the finger and plays the chords. I'm not doing that, but um, 12th fret on the G, slide to 14. And try to keep that bar, what I do know about it, keep it flat on there. If you can, put a couple fingers down to mute the strings. Slide it up to 14. Now you, 
for fret 12, you got to go directly above the fret wire to get your true pitch. So when you see a 12 or 14, it's got to be right above that fret. And then 14E, slide to 12. Oops. I'm blowing it. And I got low string action. Usually with slide, you want a pretty big gap from the neck to the strings. And then vibrato. My vibrato is horrible for slide. Anyways, keep it right around that 12th fret on the end and um, vibrato. Repeats. The next new part is uh, section 4 at 148 and man, talk about a stretch. You're going to go 3 5 E A. 3-7, 3-8, to 3-7, you need to do that four times. Now you can lift, use that thumb as a pivot so you can get the stretch. From there you're moving down I think. Yeah, same thing but on the A and D string, but two times through. Then you're back to the start one, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, two times. And then, chord time. It's um, 10, 12, 12, 12, 12. 10 on the E, and then bar the 12th fret strings five through two. To 10, 12, you're gonna strum it twice. To 10, 12, 12, 11. And it does that twice, so. And then, end with the 3-5 on the E and A. Actually, we gotta turn that over, though. To page four. Um, one time through. And then 3-5-4-6-5-7. Um, down, up, down, down. That's how I'm feeling that. Then the slide bar. Woo! Tough stuff. 14G slide to 16. And angle the bar to where it's at an angle because he's going to the 15E. Hear that? Um, definitely you're going to want to subgroup these. I don't know if you've ever played slide before. Um, 16 on the G. With vibrato, rest twice, do it again, then 17th fret, triple it, so it's down, up, down, times four, so you'll go, same thing on the 19th fret, slide, or pick the 19, slide to 22, and once you get to 22, um, you're going to go down, up, vibrato, pick, slide to 19, and once you get to 19, pick, slide to, to 17, and then 15 slide to 16, 17 D twice, so, right, 17 on the B slide to 15, and then 15 G slide to 16, so it's, okay, okay, from there, Um, 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 lost my spot. One second. Uh, 17 D three times. Third time slide to 15. And then 15 A slide to 17. Okay, from there, you'll go 17 D and then timestamp 220. You're gonna go 17 16 on the G. And then 17, 15, slide to 16. So it's vibrato. Um, 17, 16, 17, 19. So you have. All right, 222, we're gonna go 20 on the B. Slide to 18 and go to 19 G. Um, and then 15 on the high E, slide to 19. 
20 on the B slide to 18 to 19 G. And then two, time stamp um, 223 is 13B slide to 15. 15E, and it's the hold, so you want to hear two strings. Vibrato, three times. Twenty on the B, slide to eighteen. Oops. Right above the fret wire. Seventeen on the G, slide to nineteen. Eighteen B. Seventeen, slide to nineteen G. 18B. Okay, and then we can move to page 5. And that's 19G vibrato. Down, up, down, 17, 18, 19 on the G. Like that. Timing of it. The triplet. Um, once you get to 19, slide to 12. Alright, from there and back up so it's it slides way up by the pickups um, then you're going to go third fret on the B twice slide to six pick vibrato and then go three on the B slide to six and then an open E four times Oops. Pretty cool. And 3G slide to 4 to 5D vibrato. Three four on the D to open G. 3G slide to 4. So it's 4G 5D. So it's 3, 4, D, open G. 4, G, slide to 5. 5 to 6. 6 to 7. 7 to 8. 8 to 9. 8 to 9 again. And then 9, slide descending. So it's like... With the slide pressure, make sure you're not pressing too hard with it. You, you don't want to hear the frets because you're pressing too hard. 3 A and D, slide to 5. Keep that slide flat. Okay, so. And then slide to 12. Around 12, so. Um, 12 on the B, slide to 15. That'll give you this. Oops, why are we having trouble on that B? 15E, it's a hold, vibrato, so it's 15B slide, and then 11B slide to 13, 11B, to 10G slide to 12, 10G, 10G slide 12, vibrato, so 12 slide to 10 on the G, to 12D, to 10G, so it's 12, 10, 12, D, G, D. 12, slide to 14. Pick. 12, D. So it's... 245, 8th fret on the high E, slide to 10. 10, slide to 12 on the B. 12, G. So it's... Remember, right above the fret bar. 8 slide to 10 on the E, 12 G, 12 10, 12 10, 12 is D, G, D, G, D. With vibrato. So. And moving along. I like slides, you know, it's just, it's one of those things you got to put in the time to get used to it. 249, we go 16 G to 19. 18B, so we're going to angle it and go back and forth between 18B and 19G. So, B, G, B, G, B, and then move that up to 21 and 20. And do the same thing. 
G B G B G B. And then 18 G slide to 19. And do the 18 B again, and that's gonna be three times. So it's um and then 10 B slide to 12. 12 G vibrato. Um, from there, I think it's a new timestamp. Yep, 253, it's 18, 18 G slide to 19. And, uh, and then the 18 B following it. But what you want to do, you'll go 18 to 19 and then 18 B. Half step at a time until you get up by the pickup. So it's... Move it up till you get to the pickup. Um, 256, 18E, slide to 23. Um, 18E, and you're going to go 18 up to 20B down. Three times vibrato, 18 slide to 20 on the E. 20 slide to 18B. So it's 19G, so it's and 18B down up down, so down up down up slide to 20, down up down up down slide to 18, go to 19G to the 18B down up down up, and then the 18B slide to 20, down up down up. 18 high E slide to 19 to 20 B 